Hi everyone and welcome to a new episode of Thomas in Beijing. Today I'm going to talk about visa again. But this time is which step you need to go through in China. If you didn't see my first video about visa, just click here and you can know what you need to do in your country. Now you are in China with your new X1 visa. But remember, you have 30 days to transform your visa into a permanent resident visa. Your university can help you to do it. But I think it's waste time and money. Because my uni asked me to take 100 yuan to transform my visa when I can get it for free in the immigration center. That's why go to the uni, it can be useful, easier, but actually the immigration center, it's easier than go to uni. First, before apply for the permanent resident visa, you need to have your physical exam. If you follow my advice, you already did it in your country, but you need to do it again. You need to check your blood in China. They require you. For this, you just need to go to a hospital. I will put the address in the description for Beijing. You can do everything. Check your heart, your, your chest and your blood. It will just cost 400 yuan for everything. If you already did it, you just need to do, check your blood again. It will be cheaper. When you get your physical exam, now you need to take this paper plus your GW202 paper plus the admission notice and maybe the living certificate. I don't remember. If I miss something, please comment below and to tell me what I forget. With this paper, go to the immigration center or your uni, is as you want. For the immigration center, the address for Beijing is just on the description below. When you arrive to the immigration center, everything is in English. You just need to follow the step. And if the people in the office don't speak English and just only speak Chinese, and as me, you don't speak Chinese, don't worry, it's the immigration center. You have a lot of foreigners and most of them speak Chinese and English. When you go through the different steps in the immigration center, you need to leave your visa there and get the yellow paper. This yellow paper will replace your passport if you need to take the plane during one month because your passport will not be available during one month. One month after, you need to go back to the immigration center with your yellow paper. You need to pay 400 RMB to get your permanent residence visa and your passport back. Once you get your visa, you need to go back to the police station to get a new living certificate. But don't forget your passport and your contract to get this new living certificate. Now everything is done with the administration. You can enjoy your life in China during one year. Next September, I need to renew my visa and I will tell you how I did it next year. And don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. If you like this video, press like. I'm also on Facebook and Twitter. The link are on the description. Go and check it. You can also check my previous video. Just click on your screen.